a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. I got a lot of oil. <laughs> Hi, I'm Danielle. I do too much. I like hair, talking, cosplay, music, art, and stuff. Hello. Hello. Why? <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to Star Puppy. Please ignore this hater on my face. Not for the culture. Not for the. Not for the plan. You skip your routine for one night, and you pay for it forever. Today. I was determined to make a quick video. I can do it. I got a lot of questions about product recommendations. Every single head of hair is different, so I can't really give you guys a catch-all for that kind of thing. I can do it for high to medium porosity, medium density, fine strands, 4C, medium length, dry, fluff nugget. <laughs> But I did realize that there's one particular area where there's a lot more overlap in products than any other area, and that would be oils, oils. So today I'll be sharing my three top oils to use in your natural hair regardless. Before we get into the video, I just wanted you to know that I'm a weirdo and you should join me. I upload on Tuesdays and Saturdays, and if you're already enjoying my weirdness, you should subscribe. I am me, therefore weird. So let's get right on to the video. That was me trying to be a normal YouTuber. My number one catch-all oil is extra virgin olive oil. And yes, that's the great value brand. You know it, she saved coint. Extra virgin olive oil can be used for a myriad of things. I use this as a pre-poo and also on my scalp. It's just really cheap, easy, it's a nice carrier oil for custom blends, which of course I can get into if you guys are interested in my custom blend scalp oil. I will tell you tell my, my secret, secret, but you have to tell me in the comments first. This is also good as a scalp oil because it is healing. It also promotes hair growth, good circulation. It's generally just a good oil for your whole body. You can put it on your skin, you can eat it, you can cook with it, you can throw it in your hair. It's just, it's the one. It's the one, it's panacea. Next. Eden Body Works Natural Hair Oil in the Peppermint and Tea Tree. So this is my tried and true scalp oil because it's tingly. Even Body Works, light and refreshing, paraben free and no mineral oil. An exotic blend, exotic blend, it's two oils, but okay. Nourishing ingredients that penetrates the hair root to promote new hair growth. This unique formula strengthens the hair to prevent breakage. Peppermint and tea tree essential oils decrease dandruff and itchy scalp without oily buildup. So I use this every wash day. I try not to use this too much. Peppermint and tea tree are essential oils. So if you're not interested in buying this product because it is quite a markup, I think this is about $10. Um, and you're thinking of replacing it by just buying tea tree and peppermint oil. Do not do that or you'll burn yourself. <laughs> Um, buy tea tree and buy peppermint oil and use them in a carrier oil such as olive oil I can go into a whole oil thing if you guys are interested. Let me know. This is amazing It's nice and tingly. I enjoy a good tingle if you're not into the kind of invigorating tingly cool minty sensation Don't But if you are <laughs> This is the stuff for you this last oil I only use primarily on the shaft of my hair. So the first oil was an all over, it can be for scalp and hair for me. And then that peppermint and tea tree is primarily a scalp oil. And now this is primarily a hair shaft oil. These are why, the, the, see I really think these things through because you can use it for this and it, or you can use it a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. The last oil I consider an absolute essential is I got a lot of oil. <laughs> oh, oh, there is nothing more frightening than biting glass. My tiny hands can't handle all of these at the same time. So this is the Jamaican Mango and Lime brand. It is the only brand that I trust. <laughs> I have it in several different options. So this is the Alma oil, this is the mango oil, this is the lavender oil, this is the original oil, and this is the argan oil. So if I had to choose one of them, it would be this one. <laughs> Each one of these has a special thing that it's really good at doing. 
it's just a smell difference. So the only reason I bought multiples of these is because I was hunting for my favorite smell. <laughs> this brown one is the original, so if you're interested in just trying it out and just starting from ground zero, I would highly recommend this, particularly in the winter months. This is a heavy oil. So if you have fine strands, which means that the hair shaft is skinny, that means this may wear your hair down. However, I have 4C hair and it won't be weighed down no matter what. Drenching wet, it still stands like a crown. It is my crown of glory given to me by God. Not sure why I'm Russian, but it's still true. I'm gonna get real thuggish with you right now. If you just go to the stove and you just pop this up, and you just give it up just a just a, you can determine which one you like the best in my opinion this is the best smelling one quickly followed by the omelet oil and the lemongrass the lavender oil is a bit strong so watch out the argan oil smells like old lady i'm just warning you i just keep it for aesthetic purposes so Jamaican black castor oil actually can be used on the scalp. It's a bit too heavy for my scalp since it gets mad easily, but that doesn't mean that it won't work for you because actually Jamaican black castor oil is the holy grail of natural hair growth other than peppermint and tea tree. So give it a whirl, girl. <laughs> What do you think of my list of oils? Do you use all of these oils already? Have you never even heard of these oils? What are your top oils? <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this short video. Short, we'll see. If you've gotten this far in the video, you clearly like my weirdness and you should subscribe. I upload on Tuesdays and Saturdays. This has been me, Danielle, your resident weirdo. I am me, therefore weird. Say it with me now, Star Puppy. Away! Don't forget to like, share, subscribe if you enjoyed the video.